and this one is should creatine and coffee be taken together as a pre-workout what are your thoughts on it so I'm just gonna give my opinion remember this is just Lloyd's opinion so you can do whatever suits best for you now I wrote some notes to keep myself on track since I tend to ramble first thing off creatine I take creatine myself every day three to five grams usually five grams one tablespoon and I don't see it as an immediate type of supplement that gives you immediate gains you gotta look at creatine in the long run and the reason behind that is because it takes you know some time for your muscles to get saturated with the creatine to take in the water to have a bigger pump to allow you to in theory lift more weights get bigger so what I like to do is just take my creatine post-workout simple I'll take it post-workout with maybe some BCA's if I'm feeling uh, daring that day you know what I mean as far as pre-workout what can I say I enjoy taking pre-workout supplements C4 extreme nano vapor um, optimum nutrition has one as well I just like testing them and seeing how they work but could you take coffee instead as a pre-workout certainly for sure and the reason being is because coffee is a cheap alternative to pre-workouts it's got caffeine the top selling pre-workouts on bodybuilding.com have caffeine the other ingredients are they absolutely necessary for your workout not really but some people claim that you know the beta alanine is just the best and the arginine is just the best and they work pretty well but they're not absolutely needed for your workout now what I think is that as we know coffee caffeine stimulant right helps increase muscular endurance and lowers pain levels if you are lifting you know how sometimes you're just fatigued tired you're almost kind of in pain well caffeine has that stimulant that allows you to kind of push past that plateau in the end it's pretty good for lifting and the reason being is because you know it, there's several studies out there on creatine it's a pretty highly researched uh, supplement and most studies after eight weeks show a good 10 percent increase in strength levels but it's not immediate so when you think of taking creatine and coffee together as a pre-workout you know you're thinking oh I'm gonna get a good pump from the creatine and I'm gonna get good energy from the coffee you're really just gonna get maybe a little bit of energy from the caffeine it's about it you're not gonna notice the effects of that creatine instantly so in the end I would recommend just taking coffee as your pre-workout if you know you can't afford a pre-workout if you like taking pre-workouts on the opposite side of the spectrum if you're able to work out without needing pre-workouts or caffeine at all then that would be probably most beneficial because once you get on the pre-workout caffeine stimulant train it's very hard to want to do any workout without it and that's just how it goes you can ask anyone they're gonna probably tell you the same answer so if you have if you can work out without it do that if you need to work out and need the caffeine can't afford a pre-workout go with coffee if you can afford a pre-workout maybe try one that has a nice flavor that you like see if it helps you at all most of it is mental to oh you know I'm drinking this pre-workout it's gonna work for me or this caffeine is going to work for me and that's usually what helps us to get into the gym or get into our workout room whatever we do the creatine take whenever you know you can take it with a pre-workout of if you want but it's not really needed just take it three or five grams sometime during the day before your day ends lots of people like to take it right when they wake up so they don't forget to take it or before they go to sleep doesn't matter and doesn't matter if you take it with grape juice carbohydrates water in the end it all gets the same absorption rate that most people claim you'll have that guy that says you have to take it with a a juice but it doesn't matter really but that's just my opinion it's just what I think on it so in the end it's up to you if you're under 18 honestly I would say stay away from uh, caffeine if you can because it's just gonna jack up your central nervous system to where days without it just seem so so lame and dreary but days with it and you're on top of the world okay so that's my two cents on the matter. This has been Lloyd from NewWayFitness.com. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and favorite it. Helps out a lot. Leave a comment below on what you think of the video. I'll see you guys next time. Remember to be the change. Peace out.